ABL action coming your way once again as the Macau Black Bears host the Saigon Heat in the Nanhai Gym in China. We take you to the first period where the Black Bears are looking to get their second straight victory while the Heat are looking to come back from a loss against the Formosa Dreamers. Early on, both squads exchanging baskets. First one, the Nathan U drive, and then the second one, the slam and jamma by Chris Durker. And check out the eye in the sky play as Justin Young finding Kyle Barone for that alley-oop. But Mike McKinney would punctuate the first quarter, getting all the way to the rim for two, giving the Black Bears the first quarter lead. We head to the second period, where Barone able to turn garbage into gold, elevating for that end one play. Then Mike McKinney putting Barone on skates. Last second pass over to Watkins, a beauty from the reigning Heritage MVP. Now Young, the aggression getting all the way to the rim for that nice layup. And then McKinney immediately countering with a stop and pop three of his own. And Tan Sang Din would have one of the best plays of the quarter as he glides to the hoop for the two. He head to the third where the Bears clinging to a slight lead. Dan Sangdin stayed aggressive, getting all the way to the rim. He would have a nice game with 18 points for the Heat. Watkins though with a nice seal in the paint, able to score up and over his defender. Watkins would have 16 points in the game. Murphy Bernatowski would get all the way downhill and then find Barone for the last second slam jamma The Heat starting to pull away, but look at just how cool and calm Anthony Tucker is knocking down the three, but the Heat would take a fourth quarter lead. The step way back from Tucker from beyond the arc keeps his team within striking distance. But a counter from Bernatowski like a rollerball getting all the way to the rim for two. But the Bears would battle back and take a look at how Tucker ties this game. A casual step back three-pointer of his own. The Bears would take the lead but Bernatowski would tie it up eventually. And just when things seem to be going the wrong way. The Black Bears would take care of business and defend their home court winning by two, 97-95 led by McKinney's 27.